the hell is this place? Garment factory. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. Hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gem as it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The shop's on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million... multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Townley. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Hey, I love the new hair. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Ah, okay, that's their alarm. Can you get me an air vent and one of the cameras? Uh, shots come through. Camera check, alarm check, vents check. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. The same my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> No, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around. Think about it. Come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. That's correct. I was an associate producer on Sirius Cougar last season. Hey, are we gonna make that deadline? 
Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof. Construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while, needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? I'm on the roof! All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Anonymous charred remains on the highway. They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. We need to know where those vents come out. It's like a big box on the roof. I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? Geotagging tells me those vents are directly above the store. The system we need is surrounded by that wall with the barbed wire up top. Get high and get a shot of it. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. You might be able to wipe it remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die from rich assholes to rub his nose in it. But good. Alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? 
Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you could smash them easy enough, but the stones would be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. Uh, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we can cut him in. I don't work with ammo. Okay. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right. Not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, you know, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. You know, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSPD tactical teams, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door, or try to play it smart? Ah, still a hothead? Well, some things never change. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Cho. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Yeah, it might be hot and heavy in there. This guy will keep it from going bad. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris! <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? Okay. Uh, I'll look into how you can find a tack team and get their weapons, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you.
Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. 